Hi, this is Emily Zlaney. I'm with TV Guide Magazine and TVInsider.com, and I'm sitting here with the cast of Fear the Walking Dead. Woohoo! Hi, oh, you guys. Hi, good. How are you? Good. This is great. So, <laughs> season 4B is right around the corner. What can we expect? Well, I have the microphone, so. <laughs> Mic drop. Uh, <laughs> Mic drop. Um, well, I, I think what's uh, so exciting is I. I I have no idea. I have no idea what I'm about to say. <laughs> <laughs> She's so excited. What are we gonna say? Okay, there's a lot of um, the you know we're dealing with the aftermath of um, Madison Clark right. dying, and also with um, Nick Clark as well. And so we're still that's leading our characters into a new place. Um, we're gonna be there's a disaster happening as well, like a natural disaster, okay. and um, and we're gonna be split off at times, and we're gonna hopefully come back together, and we'll see how we transform and become. A new family. How was that? <laughs> you, cov you covered all of it. <laughs> now, we talked a little bit about the loss that the whole show is experiencing of Madison and Nick. Alicia? I'm ready now. You're ready. <laughs> I'm ready now. <laughs> Your character in particular has lost her entire family now. Yeah. How is she coping with that loss? Uh, not well. Um, it's, yeah, she, I was saying earlier, sh we've seen the most incredible transformation from Alicia Clark. She's gone from a regular teenage girl through four seasons. Now she's this warrior in the apocalypse who has no family left and has, I mean, has gone through so much trauma. Um, and what we're going to see finally is just her on her own. There's, you know, an episode that I can kind of tease that is just really her, a lot of her. Um, and so we finally get to see her on her own. And there's a lot of questioning whether she's going to be able to be like her mother or be better or be worse than Madison. Either want to uh, pay homage to her memory or, or not. I mean, there's just so much up in the air. And, and it does get, if we think we've seen her in a dark place, it actually gets a little bit worse before it's going to get any better. So, yeah, yeah, there's a lot going on for her. But I think it's really as heartbreaking as it was to lose both Frank and, and Kim, um, it's been an interesting narrative point to then I be able to explore Alicia by herself. Mm. Yeah. Nice. And is there still tension amongst the group? I know your character, your character and your character in particular were oh not yeah, on the show, on the show. On the show. <laughs> oh yeah, no, we all hate each other. <laughs> how, oh, how, you mean the show. The, how are the dynamics, <laughs> like how are they changing? Because in the finale, it was kind of, everyone was kind of Well, okay. yeah, we're a whole new, we're kind of, the last image we've seen was everyone around a campfire and right. and kind of a new group. It's the it's our new family. And, and I think from my point of view, I mean, Alicia's just can't even deal with that. But, I mean, would anyone else like to chime in? There's a lot of yeah. cracks under that veneer at the, at the end, I would say. The nine gathered yeah. around the campfire. I mean, there's, yes. there's a lot. I think it's, yeah. a, I think it's yeah. we're at a point. Sorry. I think we're at a point where we're in the journey to figure out what kind of group we're going to be and what our community is going to be. We're going to find um, uh, things that we have in common, but we're also going to find things that are going to possibly threaten to tear us apart. And we're going to have to be able to navigate both right. I to with a dance. Not a lot of time has passed, really. yeah. And deny while you have the mic. Um, you're also your character Lucy's coping with a huge loss, huge. losing Nick. Yeah, I mean, how is it's how is that affecting her? Going it's a lot season? because he was the reason why I joined the Clarks, the reason why I joined right. the you know them, and also I loved the idea of Madison, you know, creating a home and bring people in. Versus in season three was like nobody can come here. Definitely. So it, it was like the transformation of that mindset was like okay, I must join them. And the moment we joined together, I everything fell apart. So now she's really a mess. And yeah. But but she has to find her place in this new family, in this new place. Absolutely. And it's it's, it's really challenging. And now Mother Nature really, you know, we have a storm coming now. Yeah. Uh, but and there's no calm after the storm <laughs> either. So it's it's that's where we are. And the only other like real like relationshipy relationship we have left on the show is Jenna and Garrett, your characters. Can you guys tell us a little bit about what's going on there? Speak. You, you speak. You speak. Divorce. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're fighting, clearly. Uh, yeah, well, I, I mean, the 
like I said earlier, in a way, not a lot of time has passed in, in the season. You know, a lot has happened in a short amount of time. Now, right. now we're this new unit, and, uh, and now we're going to get to start to explore that, I guess. You know, there's, there's children involved, there's new people, and there's new friends, there's new, new cast members that will be coming in and out. It's, uh, it's going to be cool. I don't want to give anything away. <laughs> no? Nothing? Don't know what to say. Well, in the first episode, <coughs> you'll see us together. Okay. That's I one of eight. That. Okay. I can accept that. <laughs>